Yo, DBO just dropped one of the hottest edits on the planet. So now when you first log into the game, you're approached with the login screen. It's a drop down menu. And I apologize for the loudness, but you're able to click into whichever server you're going to be using. So I'm going to be pressing universe one and this opens a lot of barriers. Hopefully, uh, I mean, I'll stop yapping, but hopefully at this point, we might see other servers in that list. The reason why they did this is to promote, not promote, to put in a different menu option for their newest server. And we'll see that in the, we'll see that once it's done loading. So as you can see here from the login screen, I can select any of the servers. If I click the Vietnamese server, there is the Chongxin server and this is their reset server every year they are going to make this reset the leaderboards every person's account straight up gets wiped and they reset it every year um they've also included the other vietnamese server so you see 12 here that's why i'm hopeful that we might see something here maybe like a combination of the two servers here or something of that nature but in any case let's talk about the game differences almost immediately you can see a different ui or a new component rather if you click this you have access to the vip capsule that you have if you are rocking with the not <laughs> the not capsule the not vip capsule the other capsule that isn't vip so i don't know why it took me so long to say that but if you don't have the special capsule then that is not there you aren't able to access the the vip the, the capsule shop obviously the capsule to be able to capsule out but if you use the regular capsule it'll still show up in the ui a lot of players have asked or one of the probably best ideas was to make this a Batora icon, and I agree 1000%. One thing I'm noticing right now is when I load into home, everything looks... I get that weird flash. I think you definitely see it if I see it. But it, it's like it preloads. Yeah, that's weird. Um, But hopefully it's hopefully it's an issue that will fix be fixed within this year. One of the biggest issues that I've seen is when a player, when a Saiyan ties while other players are fighting, that tie will stop them from fighting. So I'm going to shoot a tie here. And almost immediately, my player just stops fighting. All right, I'm going to do this one more time. All right, yep. As soon as a tie is launched, automatically players stop fighting. And I think this is a huge step backwards for the game. Oh, I just realized my audio wasn't working. So what I'm going to be doing is having it so that I tie when my Namekian is fighting this wooden dummy to test if it's something that the devs changed permanently across all versions or if this is just a, two, a glitch in 2.3.9. These two windows here are running 2.3.6 as indicated by the layout of the video. And uh, since this is now loaded, I'm going to shoot it out. Okay, so that shows to me that the issue is with 2.3.6. Oh, I apologize. The issue is with the version 2.3.9. What I'm going to do is mix and have a, a Saiyan shoot the tie from version 2.3.6. Versus having the Saiyan shoot from 2.3.9 and the tagger, you know, vice versa. 
all right so just to recap my namekian is fighting this wooden dummy i want to see if version 3 2.3.9 of tie is what's going to mess up not again all right so my namekian is fighting that i'm gonna wait for one more wooden dummy and then shoot it when it's in the middle that way there's no discrepancy let's see all right so i'm gonna shoot that right now okay so it looks like it's an error when it's somebody running 2.3.9 because i'm gonna shoot a tie on 2.3.6 and then the attacker is going to be on version 2.3.9 all right, as soon as that wooden dummy comes back, I'm going to. Okay, all right. So if you are running version 2.3.9 and a Saiyan ties a monster, you are going to be glitched. You're not going to be able to fight it. Uh, this is similar to when players use a bomb. So I'm going to attack a dummy on this is this is applies to any version. So I'm going to attack a dummy. And then I'm going to use a Makanko Sapo, and my character right here isn't going to be fighting anymore. So we're gonna we're gonna watch that right now. All right, I stand corrected, uh, but this does ha this happens more primarily with bosses where if somebody uses any sort of bomb, then the the attackers will stop. I'll try and see if that happens when i use the spirit bomb and i used it on the wrong uh, enemy that's really cool but regard oh yeah you see it there the um the attacker of the wooden dummy stopped so it's it's having the same effect and this there's still a workaround for players that don't want to be affected by this which is use a lower version so any version underneath 2.3.9 will still allow you to be unaffected by bosses or by by this glitch i hope that it does get fixed um that's def that's this is a huge glitch and hopefully it gets fixed um that's why i wanted to make that video there so this still is a big quality of life change if you are a solo player because like one of the biggest issues I had was clicking through this menu, scrolling through, finding the VIP capsule, and then hoping to goodness that... Wow. Looks like there's a glitch already with this. I cannot click the VIP capsule. So, which literally means I need to go through here anyways. Unless I'm glitched right now. Unless my... Okay, I think I'm just going to have a connection error. That That looks like what it is. I don't know what happened. I honestly, I think 2.39 has a lot of like issues or something with it because I, I went to the market and then everything just kind of everything just went bad. I think it might be a connection error on my, on my end, um, but there's always there's always room for there's always room for error on both sides. You know what I'm going to do what, where I left off on was using the capsule. I want to see if there is an issue with using the capsule repeatedly. So I'm going to go to Beerus Planet, and then I'm going to go right back to Guru Island. Okay, so that that was probably just my internet going <laughs> haywire, right? Uh, real quick, I want to check Satan's job real quick. So sometimes, sometimes they have some uh, really good items after a big update. Nope. Nope. Which, by the way, T-Mobile, if you're watching this, please make this either a larger expiration date or make a permanent variety. Nobody wants a disguise, which is, which is like 10 gems per day. Like, dog. All right. Um, Yellowtail white cat. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Literally the same thing as before. Nothing, uh, nothing too out of the ordinary. Yeah. All right. Um, well, that's the biggest UI changes. That's the biggest changes from version 2.3.9 and below to 2.3.9. It probably would have been better if I used 2.3.7, but I don't think I have access to that version. So, uh, yeah, load a like, load a 
Lord of subscribe, Lord of peace. Let me know if I missed anything and we'll go from there. See you.